Yes, indeed, a time not meant to exist. We're now living in a carbon copy world of what used to be the true experience of life. That's very true. I personally have been exposed to information that has led me to believe this reality ended in 1982. That's why people are so uncertain about everything. They're muddled and confused. Nobody knows what to think about anything anymore. Everything is moving in circles. There's nothing left, blimey. Uh-huh. It's like hamsters going round and round in his cage. Absolutely. Why? Because we've reached a brick wall and do nothing but reach to the past to recycle, where instead of expanding out more possibility, we have these belief systems which are nothing more than programs. Yes. The idea is to keep us in a total and constant state of confusion. The war isn't in Iraq, Iran, Afghanistan, or Saudi Arabia, or wherever. It's with realities. It's the conflict of manipulated realities. I mean, uh, that vehicle gets 11 miles to the gallon. Maybe. Drink two. Cheers. His successor was a woman called Esmit Oscar. signing, but uh, nobody showed up. Oh my god. I don't know what happened to this place, but what was it signing for? Uh, it's about Gravitrons and uh, the effect of the uh, dead zone. Dead zone? Like the dead zones in the ocean where there's no oxygen levels and no life exists? Uh, yes, you could think of it that way. I mean, that's that's one way of looking at it. And I, I came up with that just as a way to understand it. I guess that's the influence of Stephen King, I guess. Uh, oh. And that's how he came to the dead zone. Here it is. Here's the book. Oh, yeah, well, that's, uh... Everything is moving in circles. There's nothing left, blimey. Create some perspective and pull back, but at the same time, you're looking at both the micro and the macro aspect of it, so... And that's where the black particles come Wow, well, wait a minute, black particles? You know about the black particles? I think I can see them. Well, no, so nobody can see the black particles. I can't see the black particles. No, I can see them. I've been seeing them my whole life. No, that's impossible. No, I can I've never see seen them. them. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. 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 Yes.
Can you please give me some modicum of understanding of what the hell went on back there? What the hell is going on around here? Yeah, I'm what wondering. I'm actually wondering the same thing because I thought you were supposed to pick up my sister. I did. Well, where is she? Well, it's not me. I think you're you. Oh, throwing stuff at me. I'm not. But these things are coming out of nowhere. I have no idea what these things are. They're making all this weird noise. It's like. Can you please tell me why you didn't pick up my sister? I thought you were supposed to. I did pick up your sister. Oh, well, where is she then? Who are you? I told you, okay? I'm Dushine. D-E-W-S-H-I-N-E. Dushine, with a capital D, please. Whoa! Where the hell did you go? Where the hell did you come from? Uh, I don't know. God, I just couldn't do it! Jesus, what? I couldn't go in. I met Bob Lazar. I don't know who that is. He's the greatest scientific mind of our generation. I thought Richard Hoagland was the Einstein of our generation. You don't understand anything. What happened to you? Where did you go? I mean, you were so anxious to get to the Bodhi tree. I mean, you were so anxious to get to the Bodhi tree. And then you just vanished. Just drop me off at home. Why don't we swing by the $2 theaters like old times? Just you and me. We'll see some, uh, really bad movies, right? I Dollar thought, hot dogs? I thought you were broke. Uh, I've been saving up some change. Come on, what do you say? We'll see anything. I only want to see the new Twilight movie. Uh, anything but that. Come on, we'll see The Hobbit, as long as it's not in blurry vision 3D. I hate Peter Jackson. How about the new Spielberg, uh, Abraham Lincoln movie? I want to see Ridley Scott's Prometheus. Oh yeah, wait, wait. that came out a couple months ago, right? My brother works at Digital Domain, remember, Chris? It got delayed. There's nothing. The Twilight movie, I told you. No way. Come on, no way. I really want to see it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Forget it! I'm walking home! Doctor, wait! That crazy son of a bitch! What, did, what the heck is he doing? That's your room? You've been thrown out by your landlady. It's your notice of eviction. You need to vacate the premises forthwith. Okay? We understand each other? Thank you. Thank you. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me. Uh, you really can't be here. You have a few seconds to go. Or you will go to jail. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? You will go to jail. Mm -hmm. Sounds great, thank you. Yes, roger that.
here. No, I told you I would give you the money. All you had to do was leave me alone. But I have nothing to lose. But no, you just kept pushing me. Where am I supposed to go? What am I supposed to do? Get out of here. No, I told you I would give you the money. You, mean you couldn't leave me alone, could you? I have nothing to lose now. Because you just keep pushing me. No, I have nothing to lose. You just kept pushing me. Pushing me. Okay, this is it. It's time to leave the physical airplane. Do shine. Yes. You're Fox Fur's sister. But what happened to you? They fired me from the Bodhi tree. But why are you in a wheelchair? I don't know. I'll go score some donuts for us. Okay. Yeah, I want that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I want that one. The pink one. The blue one. I want the jelly filter. Billy, can you buy that one for me? I want the pink one. Blimey, people, wake up! We must change the frequency of this planet, the resonance, back to. Even the technological progression Shut is all up! based on the seeds Shut of invention. It started in the 60s Shut and 70s and the early 80s. Blimey, people! Shut up! Shut up! The resonance of this planet back to its normal cycle. Shut up! get angry when confronted with the truth. Okay, let me get you up. Okay. We've got to get you safe. You're one of the greatest thinkers of this generation. We can't lose you. Yeah, you know, we're made of stardust, and I don't yes. know why people don't realize that they yes. act like it or something. They do. They Wait do. Up. What's that? What's yes. That? Look, I'm sorry about it earlier, man. I got this blood pressure thing, and... I didn't mean to insult you. My name's Clive, man. I'm David. David, nice to meet you. All right, David. All right. Hey, where are you guys doing? We have to get him to a shelter. Oh, I know a great shelter. Do you live around here, Clive? Yeah, I live right down the street, but I know, I know it's a great shelter for you, man. Wait, can, I, can I come along with you guys? Well, how far is it? It's not far. It's like maybe a mile down the road. Okay, we have to move really fast. Absolutely. You know, like, come help. I mean, I'm a nice guy. I mean... I just got this thing with blood pressure, and I get a, I get a little bit out of control, you know. And I promise you won't have any kids. You're going to see suppression and limitation replaced by expansion and infinite potential. Now, I believe that the human race has developed a form of collective schizophrenia in which we are not only slaves to this imposed thought behavior, but we are also the police enforcing it. <laughs> <laughs>